Sorry, guys. Sorry that it's early. Hartley up, up, is the up. one to blame, really, because he's so far away. Yeah. yeah we have Lord. to accommodate his time zone. Freaking Hartley. What Every time is it for you, Hartley? Uh, It's just past four. Like 4 p.m.? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you guys want to know what time it really is? It's, yeah. it's the Mac Rumors Awards time. That's what we're calling yeah. this. Yeah. yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, we have the Genius Bar podcast with us. Oh, yes. No, wait. Do it again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Welcome, everyone. Whoa, we're yeah. just going. Yeah. Let's you're, go. You're a sneaky little guy. You're a sneaky little guy, Dan. We're one second I'm asking about Hartley's personal life. Next second we're in the show. I try. I like to do that. I like to figure out a way now instead of just doing this grand old intro. Although we will do a little bit of an intro because this is the first time we've ever done an award show. And let me tell you, we've gone weeks of extensive planning. And by weeks, I I mean weeks. Definitely not. We came up with the categories I yesterday no and a part of this morning. <laughs> And then asked, and then asked John, and then asked John and Sam about two days ago. No, there was a lot of planning involved in this. Okay, okay. <laughs> but uh, no, we thought it would be fun to do like a year in review, and um, we wanted to just try to do it a little bit differently. So we came up with a few categories, and we also thought we would give you the categories ahead of time, and then realize we're not going to do that. We're just going to have you go yeah, in blind. I'm going in totally blind. No one has told me anything. Yeah. Well, okay. here we go. This is going to be difficult because. Uh, you know, you really got to think. So we're going to – we'll let Hartley go because he's the most prepared out of everyone. Okay. And then you, and then you, you us, can – Do you want Sam and I to just play our sound effects? Is that why we're here? Uh, <laughs> yes. yes, please. Give out awards. Yes, please. <laughs> Category uh, number one. Yeah. <laughs> uh, honestly, let's just jump right into it. Hartley, which one do you think we should do? I'll let you pick from the list. Uh, let's do uh, best Apple rumor story of the year. Oh, <laughs> can, I, can we go to last year? Again. Uh, <laughs> wait, what were you gonna say? I said flat Apple Watch again, part two. Is that say. really your? Uh, is that really your choice? <laughs> <laughs> well, Hartley, you go first, and you guys think about what yeah, what was the best rumor that you've heard this year? Whether it was like an outrageous, like it's the best <laughs> because it was so ridiculous, or it really was like, oh, that's cool. I hope it does come to fruition or whatever. Hartley, you go ahead. So for me, uh, my sort of favorite story this year is how it, everything kind of developed with Dynamic Island That's because it, it did kind of come out of nowhere. And the way that um, when we were imagining how the front of the iPhone 14 Pro would look, um, the way it just it just has not turned out that way. Um, and the way that it kind of trickled out very slowly over that weekend, um, exactly how the software would interact with it and kind of trying to imagine how it would look um, in that last weekend before the actual unveiling. Um, and then the way that that just kind of really dominated what people took away from the iPhone 14 Pro. I thought it was really, one of those really satisfying things. A little bit like how there was the MacBook Pro notch story last yes. year. Like those last minute things that come out. Uh, so for me, it's going to be Dynamic Island. I agree. That's my, my answer as well. Okay, guys, we cannot let Hartley go first and then everyone just agree on it because that was my plan. Oh, no. I was, like, waiting to go last, like, when you're at a table with everyone and everyone's ordering, but you're not actually ready. So I'm just, like, yeah. trying to think while everyone's giving an answer. Everyone's I just have... Googling right now. What's the – honestly, he's right, though. I When we talked about this, my – Initial thought was the MacBook Pro notch, but that was last year. And so yeah. the Dynamic Island is honestly just like a – just the, the the most natural follow-up to it because I honestly ignored all of those rumors right before it happened because I'm like, that's not happening. That just seems ridiculous. Uh, and then it, it did. did. It did. <laughs> it did. Yeah. Does anyone have give... anything different? Though? I have I – ha well, I th I don't know if I'm breaking the rules. There's no rules. But, okay. <laughs> what do you mean? Because, because it's not just one rumor. It's more like what happened with a certain person. Do it. Is that Sam? Are the sirens yeah, behind you yes. already? Who's, live, who's Dude, got a crime going on right now? Bro, unavoidable. Any <laughs> podcast, anytime I hit record, the sirens, man. Somebody's just like, the second I hit record, somebody's like... <laughs> <laughs> they just need they need medical assistance like i i, I probably killed hundreds of people <laughs> it's just you that are like damn it he's recording again it's, it's time to uh i think yeah. my pick is shrimp apple pro i think the evolution of shrimp apple pro has been the coolest thing for me to watch like last year he had he had a couple bangers but this year he really solidified himself as like 
you know, someone who's really respectable and uh, reputable. And I think that um, I think that's the coolest thing for me. So not just not just one rumor, but uh, in the rumor mill, the evolution of uh, this weird shrimp account uh, is my favorite. I don't know. Yeah, no, it's crazy. Like he, he's really good. Um, and I just think it's funny because no one believes you when you say this is from Shrimp Apple Pro. Like a, he should have just chosen any other name <laughs> because it's like, I mean, like the verge is never reported on anything. Like they can't be like leaker shrimp, apple pro on like a triple yeah. news website. Anytime like, I do a video where I have to say his name, I, I literally laugh and yes. it's, I just like, I can't help, but it's you feel a like funny you have name. to explain it, but like, yeah. it's, then it's too much to explain. So just accept yeah. it. <laughs> so I just giggled at myself. While I just He's had hit after hit in terms of rumors. I mean, yeah. if we if we think back, it's stuff like Apple Watch Series Eight, um, the color options, a bunch of stuff. For the iPhone fourteen. I mean, he was first yeah. to the um, uh, to the cutouts that would replace the notch and ultimately be dynamic island. Um, so, absolutely, some I great didn't stories. believe yeah, that. I think that's for a good second. Choice. That was like his first leak, and it just happened to be the front of an yeah. iPhone fourteen. No, no biggie. I believed it, and I covered it, and I just want to say, I was right. You guys were all wrong. Okay. What's your rating on Apple Track? Is it a hundred? Zero. Zero. <laughs> Apple Track's dead. Uh, Actually, uh, no, Apple Track's very alive, rip. just not the Don't website. it's not dead. Somebody might be acquiring it. Is it John? I don't know, but somebody's <laughs> interested in the leaderboard. That's all I can say. <laughs> somebody's interested. <laughs> Unless Mac it. Rumors wants it back. <laughs> you guys want to bring your leaderboard back. Hey man, we'll talk. Um yeah. No, okay, I do you won't. <laughs> this is how we drive the price up, baby. Yeah. <laughs> Arnold's going to be listening. He's like, I'm not buying anything. What are you talking about? <laughs> um, okay, so I do have an alternative real quick before we move on to the next category. What is going on with Apple Music Classical? That's the one rumor that I'm just like. Oh, that's we... what you picked, Dan? You had, no. a, you had 12 months of rumors. <laughs> and you picked no. that. No, no. I had about three minutes before this podcast okay. and to then think. hardly took doors man's over and here like <laughs> <laughs> yeah he's, he's wondering he's wondering where the british are coming with uh with the violin here i don't know dan that's not even a rumor they just said it was coming and it's not here <laughs> yeah that's a rumor of apple's own that i'd like for them to address <laughs> put out their own rumors Oh. All right, fine. What about the best feature introduced in a new product this year? Oh. Not like a new, entirely new product space, just whatever was new this year. Yeah. I'll go. I'll go first. No, you me, won't. No? Go <laughs> ahead, John. Be, well, this should be this is easier, right? Because there's been loads of new features. So, uh, go ahead. Uh, for me, but if you it take would mine, be, I'm going to be upset. Uh, it would be touch controls on the AirPods Pro 2. Um, just because oh. the, the volume controls, oh. that's oh, it's so yeah. well because it yeah. adds a whole new layer of um, uh, of interaction to the device that I've always wanted uh, volume controls yeah. um, on AirPods. So I was really happy to see that something I've wanted for years. That's a really good answer. I approve of that. What happens if you okay? Didn't next category. <laughs> uh, I storm <laughs> off. No, uh, here I'll, I'm gonna I'm gonna just make John go last now because he's a little baby. Um, okay. I think the best feature is a dynamic island. Seriously, dude. Sam, why? Why I, the way that you are? Everyone is wrong. I, I think I'm gonna make a video about this because my last video in the iPhone 14 Pro, like talking about something did well, and I, 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 I love the Dynamic Island. Like I, I use it every single day. It makes me smile every single day. It, it makes controlling my home pods and music so much easier. Um, genuinely. <laughs> The, my favorite feature from Apple in years. Everyone's like, it's mid. You don't even do nothing. Like, dude, <laughs> Flighty in the Dynamic Island, which is like a flight tracking app, is just game changing. Uber now has the Dynamic Island game changing. Yeah, Dynamic Island is super cool. It's brilliant. And it, it's like that combined with not expecting it that made it so beautiful. I'm going to make a video why I hate the Dynamic Island just to oppose yours. You can, no, John, I, you, I don't even hate it. I just want to go against your video. Bro, make a TikTok and I'll stitch you. And I'll just okay. scream. Let's do it. <sighs> um, okay, John, do you want to go next or do you want me to go next? Yeah, I got it. Uh, okay. <laughs> obscure. This is this is almost as bad as uh, your Apple Music classical thing. Uh, I okay. Actually, okay. 
I really love the new uh, settings layout in Mac OS. You are. <laughs> I, I said. I said what Bro, I said. What is wrong with you? I said what I said. No. What? You picked Dynamic Island and said it made no, you no, smile. No, no, no. That's it's not like a weird. Outside. Bro, everyone universally hates the settings in Ventura. Apparently not everyone, because I How don't. How do you... It's not usable. Well, that makes sense, because you're not really a usable person anyway. So, like, of course you would <laughs> like this. It's like this... Wor like, you are a bad UI as a person, uh, so I get why you like it now. Organize much better. No. no oh. Oh, you're bud. You're Dan, clinically what's, what is your, what's yours? Oh, mine's just as terrible. Well, it's not terrible. It's just boring. But, like, I think it's one of the most useful things that's ever come out in in an iPhone. And that is 2,000 nits of peak outdoor brightness. Someone who uses their phone outside a lot, if mm. I'm out there and I'm walking around, I, I'm, like, and I wear sunglasses. Like, I have to, like, mm. squint brightness all the way up. Your phone's a million degrees. I've talked about this before. I think that's the best part of the new display is that it just – automatically jolts up and you can see everything and uh i don't know if i have another one actually it, it's it's bigger oh, bat bi bigger battery in the ultra in the apple watch ultra mm. that's uh, i don't know if that's really a feature but just yeah, it's a really it's, good it's, it's a really good idea and they should do that with all apple watches somehow. can can sam <laughs> can i give out an award <laughs> I think we need to go back on this Mac OS settings thing here. I'm still kind of... Yeah. I would like to give out an award to Sam Cole for uh, being a great big phony. Because for the last, I don't know, eight months, nine months, a baby amount of time, he has been going all over the uh, the satellite feature, talking about how that's the biggest game changer and that's the best thing. And then when it comes to the Mac Rumors Award to pick your favorite feature, he forgets about it and, and then names the Dynamic Island because it makes him smile. It does make me smile. Okay, the satellite, I'm picking that as my second. No, you can't. It's over. You only get oh. it's one award. Dude, you kinda got me you kinda got me. I Wait, can I, I change my rumor thing? I wanted to make it that, but only for the specific reason of uh <laughs> so that me and Sam can argue about the 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 event. Remember? You didn't get a chance to dunk. Oh, no. I I didn't get a chance to dunk on Dan. I <laughs> said a hundred percent this is coming, dude. When I was in the little press section at Apple Park, they put me in the bleachers, of course. Flex. Um, when I was literally in the outdoor tent on our 720p 30-inch TV watching the event, <laughs> I saw a satellite in the intro, and I let out a squeal. <laughs> Dude, I, I went, why do we <gasps> have – And I people didn't... were like, what? And I'm like, you'll see. You'll see. You just remember that Dan from Mac Rumors is somewhere in the world – crying so my argument wasn't my argument wasn't that it wasn't going to be a thing we all knew that it was coming it was oh, that no, it was that no, yeah yeah yeah, no, yeah. Dan, oh no Dan, it was no, that no, for all no, the rumors it was that the event invite has nothing to do with the main focus of the show now tell me how much time did they spend on the satellite communication portion of the event so much so much time. <laughs> no it was like it was like oh, three man, minutes you shouldn't have brought this up <laughs> I did say he could dunk on me, although he's doing a very a poor job. Huge it's it was a like huge three part. minutes. A silly little guy. Silly little guy in Ohio. Do you actually Ohio like things. the feature? Have you tested it? Have you been stranded in the world sometime? Are you? Is this a joke? No, you is can actually te you can actually test it. Yeah, I made an entire video about it, Dan. I don't I was watch. The world's first person to test it in the wild. I worked with the police <laughs> department to actually show it instead of being inside. Like you're, you know. I was out. I was outside. Oh, I used the test mode. Anybody can do that, Dan. Did you work with the police department? Did you get yelled at by an old woman because you were on her property? No. Okay. You yeah, beat I me went there. Hard for satellite. I just mode. don't watch YouTube, man. I just I don't even know what it is. Yeah. This is just disrespect. John, can we leave? <laughs> I don't want to be here anymore. You told me to it I didn't know anything well, about it. Dan, I was so tired. I was chilled out, and then you bring up the satellite mode, and all of a sudden things get a little crazy. <laughs> now all right, everybody from Mac Rumors is going to be like he's weird. Okay, nice. I mean, technically, I brought it up because you forgot about your your favorite feature in quotes. <laughs> yeah, blame John. Wait, did Hartley go on this one? Yeah, yeah, he said this, uh, he's, AirPods. Oh, right, right. He was first. All he right, then. What's winner. the worst feature uh, introduced in a new product this year? Dynamic Island. No one's allowed to say <laughs> Dynamic Island. <laughs> okay, but that's not a bad dude. Shut up. You're just, you're like that's just ridiculous. <laughs> 
It's not a Genius bad suggestion. feature. It's just <sighs> not as useful as I thought it would be right now. But also, yeah, I haven't experienced yeah. Uber because I haven't gone anywhere since it's come out. Um, <laughs> you just live in your basement? I, all, yeah, all man. Well, I mean, like, I don't need to Uber <laughs> to the grocery store. I've got a car, so I don't, I don't yeah. need to do that. Yeah, but, like, I haven't, be. like, traveled around where Uber is important for me. You know the um, grocery store will bring the groceries to you now, right? It's oh, 20%. no, I like, to, I like to go. I have three kids, man. I got to get out there sometimes and just, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I need to go grocery shopping, okay? <laughs> just send Listen, them. when you guys are blackout drunk at noon on a Saturday, watching the little Uber car move across a dynamic island brings you some sort of hope. Why are okay, you blackout drunk say. on noon on a Saturday? <laughs> Listen, it's been a hard year for Apple leaks. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying the dynamic islands. Are, I just, does ever, so John, you unironically think that's the worst feature. No, I don't think that's the worst feature. No. Okay, good. All right, well, so someone give us their worst feature. Harley, would you Harley, like I to go? I think Harley should go. <laughs> I mean, it's uh, obvious. It's it's a bit of a stretch because it's not really a new feature, but they did have to choose to put this feature in, and that would be uh, first generation Apple Pencil on the uh, on the mm. tenth generation iPad because it just Bruh. it's just the charging yeah. situation is just laughable. So that that I understand yeah. why the decision was made, but it's just it's not a it's not a good decision. It's not a good feature. That's a, that's a fair answer. Anyone else? Dan. Wow, it's, what are you? It's real, real, real you, quiet. Um, I don't know that I have one right now. <laughs> you made so this, this show. Oh. No. I mean, did I though? In you what real? In what reality? I was told this was um, a Mac Rumors award show, and Mac Rumors is always prepared. That's what I know. So this was an optional category that I just decided to pick at this moment in time. So I was worst prepared for that worst one. feature ever. Not worst feature no, ever. Worst year. feature in a new product this year. Worst feature ever this year. <laughs> yeah, um, in a new product. I. Uh, it's hard to pick this up. This is bad. like. Right. That's why I'm struggling. Because like. I I'm gonna say it. The Apple TV 4K only having Ethernet on one of the models. That's bad. They should just put it on all the models. Can that's what. That? That's what we dug out of the mud for this one. That's yeah. the worst. Yeah. Can we collectively agree on that one? I think so. Yeah. It's pretty bad. Ooh, and if you pressure AirPods in, it makes air come out. I've never done that. That's why they're called you AirPods. Prob- okay. Whoa, dude. Everybody with AirPods, <laughs> if you're listening, just push in on them. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All right. Let's move oh, on. No, 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 you got no, one? No, no. You got one? You got one? Yes. The update to AirPods Max that made the noise cancellation worse. Oh. That would be no. You want to save that one? Save that one. I will. Ooh. I will put it. Write it down. Fold it up on a piece of paper. Put it in my pocket. Save it for later. It's saved. All right. See, I tried to buy you time, but now we can't even use. It. All right. All right. Hold on. We'll we'll, we'll pivot this category. Not also. Necessarily... I am. I have, I have turned the heat up so high in my house, and I'm so cold. It's negative seven here in Arkansas. Yeah, it's about to be super cold here in a day. <sighs> yes, uh, but wait, hold on. I'm going to change this to make it a little bit easier. Not worst feature, worst product this year. Worst. No. Product. I can go if you need to, if you need a minute. Yeah, yeah, yeah go, you, go, go, you go. All right, yeah. the dual USB-C adapter. <laughs> that one is by far <laughs> the worst, simply because it's way overpriced, and you can get something better uh, for uh, like half the price from anyone can else. Can I pick? Can I pick the dongle that you have to use to charge your Apple? Pencil first gen on your yes. These are all acceptable that's answers. That's what. I also, I think the Apple TV 4K is pretty terrible, just because okay, there's really Dan. Okay. just because Not just because terrible. there's nothing to it. Well, there's nothing new to it. There's no reason but, to go buy. But is it terrible? When yeah. you no, no, the product isn't terrible. Karaoke. Just it's the worst new product that was announced this year because it was completely. Great. You can't. Who I cares think, about Apple Music? Who cares about Apple? Music I think that's karaoke? my favorite new you feature. You just said Apple Music Karaoke. No, that's you. We're doing a software one. Just hold on. Oh, damn. We would have oh. known this if you gave us the category. <laughs> no, it's, <laughs> it's it's better to do it in the dark. All right, Literally. I've got one that I think we'll actually agree on. Worst product of the year to me is absolutely the Apple Watch Series Eight. Mm. Okay, so you can pick one that has a very minor update, but I can't. That's what I'm saying. Listen, you both are saying it's nonsense. my show. It's not a bad product Our if it's show. just the same. 
So it's, a, it's an underwhelming update. It's yeah. like there's, right, a whole, there's a whole bunch of Worst like, updated pro, product of 2022. <laughs> the main feature only works for half the population, and it's not me. <laughs> What's the it main feature? It can be if you want it to be. Temperature sensing to track your uh, ovulation cycle. Oh, it still senses your temperature, right? In, uh... Sam, you've been, you've been using that. It's been working. Yeah, for sleep. For sleep. No. You can still do it in sleep. Here's my thing, actually. I um, I only have the Ultra because I want to talk about this later, but I, I can't really – you can't really sleep with the Ultra, I feel like. It's a little um, – it's a little – It's definitely harder. I also you don't sleep do with it. the S sleep anyway. I, I don't like wearing something on my wrist when I sleep. Okay. Um, it's me. I don't like wearing anything on my person at all when I sleep. We'll move on unless somebody has something. Hartley, since I did change the category about halfway through this, uh, worst product, if you'd like to just do the overall product, not necessarily a feature. Do you have one? Uh, overall product, mm, that's tricky. Maybe the uh, – I, I agree with Sam about Apple Watch Series 8, but maybe we could just go with the standard iPhone 14 because no, mm. it was just so underwhelming. <laughs> No one what, cares what? about it. Sorry, what was that? Was what, was the, what was that? <laughs> <laughs> he pressed the wrong sound bite. What was the other one that you pressed? It's fine. You'll find out when you're editing. You'll find out when okay. You're editing. I'm sorry, Hartley. I was supposed to be an applause because I agree. Um, but yeah, so just uh, iPhones, iPhone 14, iPhone 14 Plus, most underwhelming mm. iPhone since iPhone XS, maybe. Yeah. They're not okay, some yeah. at all. The plus is cool. It's gonna be the number one seller this year. <laughs> I don't. Is yeah, it? The, mini, the mini was more fun. The mini was a more fun product. No, the mini. I thought the plus sucked. sales were doing terribly as well. No, they. They. I think they are. Yeah, and it's, Sam, and it's so Sam expensive. Sam and I on Genius Bar for like the last forever. We kept before it came out. We were saying it's gonna be the top selling iPhone, but we Which were. I, I wouldn't have argued that against that. Yeah. Well, it depends where it's uh, priced, right? It's it's like it's a hundred dollars off the off the yeah. pro. Yeah, that's true. They should have done eight forty nine, like seven forty nine and eight forty nine, hmm. or five ninety nine and seven fifty. Yeah, the iPhone fourteen isn't worth. It's not better than a Pixel Seven Pro, and that's oh, okay. Well, that's uh, not a fair statement. But okay. uh, I mean, from Android. what you get from a fee well, okay, guys, let's not. Uh, can't handle. It, it, did you see the? Ca compute. Did you see the? Did you see the MKBHD camera test? A Pixel Six A. No, oh, I thought, bro. I thought you don't watch YouTube, Dan. <laughs> I just don't watch oh, Sam's YouTube. Oh, <laughs> Dan, do we have something to talk about? <laughs> Little skeezer over here. I didn't uh, see no, it. I just I saw the results on Twitter. Oh yeah, yeah. I also saw the satellite feature on Twitter. <laughs> I'd like to do the show with Hartley next time. Okay, well, Hartley, <laughs> then why don't you lead us into our next category? I'll just sit Dan, you want to do Genius Bar with me? And then uh, Sam can just be with Hartley? We can just sure, swap? that's awesome. Yeah, that'll yeah. be fun. <laughs> like podcast swingers. You know, well, you know what? I'm not going to accept any invitations, certainly not to co-host, until I actually get invited as a guest. But we'll talk about you're, that You're invited, time. Dan, you're officially. When? when? Right, when? Next right now? Like, right yeah, am I doing sure. after this? <laughs> right now. <laughs> <laughs> You can't you claim this week? podcast yeah, as yours right week? now. Well, yeah, sure. Sam, do we uh, do we have a guest next week? I don't think we do. Bro, you told me to not ask a guest because you wanted to uh, unalive yourself. Because the editing is crazy? That's fine. Yeah. Dan, you're up next week. Welcome. Mm, cool. <laughs> if you accept the invitation, that is. We'll see how the rest of this goes. No, I need an answer right now. Okay, yes, I accept. Oh. Let's go! <laughs> <laughs> this is going to be really embarrassing for you guys if I... Uh, if I'm not on next week, what are you gonna? What's gonna happen between now and then? Oh, I didn't say anything was gonna happen. Why do we have to get so dark about it? <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, Hartley, introduce us into our next category. This is getting off the rails. Uh, just how I was like, oh, so Hartley Let's... knows the categories too. Yeah, we yeah. made the show. <laughs> he made the show. Let's just be clear. <laughs> yeah, but you were all asleep when I when I made it. It's a, t yeah. it's a time zone. <laughs> he has a five hour real. head start. Hartley is the glue that keeps everything together, really. This is very true. I would be it nothing been, without it. has been said. Uh, <laughs> so uh, let's do uh, best feature introduced in a software update. Um, so for me, this would be something stupidly simple, which would just be display zoom on uh, iPad Pro. Really? It, yeah, I, oh. I love it. 
it, like it's it could like it's completely it's changed the way I use my iPad. I've wanted it for years because the iPad's always felt ridiculous <laughs> in the way that everything scales on it. So what do you just do so, the smaller scale? I presume you don't want it bigger. Yeah. and then you yeah. you can fit so much more on, on a twelve point nine inch iPad Pro. Um, it just it makes it a more useful device. I mean, it's still it's huh. it's more useful than Stage Manager. It makes it way. Ooh, it's wait, way hold on. That's the next category. category. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, that's 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 why I. Uh, that's all right. All right. All right. Side. That's the good feature. What do this I do? It would have been awesome if we had notice about these categories. <laughs> um, I definitely. Yeah. Dan said they were going to send them. I didn't get a, a wink of sleep because I was just waiting all night. I just kept <laughs> yeah. looking at my Dan from Mac Rumors chat, and it's all like I got was for that boy to take you to prom. Yes, when he, the they never, he never texted. Uh, I would say the best feature is Apple Music Sing. Oh, my God. Seriously, dude? Dude. How often are you using yeah. it, honestly? It's, it's, I've been, I've been, I've been, la, 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 you know? I don't, yeah. I don't want to get, I, I mean, hey, if I would what? sing. Go get a song. Let's go. Show no, us what I, you can I, do with I, it. I don't want you guys to do a copyright strike what, pretty hard. Yeah, I was going to say. I, I It'll be totally so, worth like, it. So <laughs> close to key that, like, usually YouTube just insta I mean, even Ecamm, the software will flag it and we'll, we'll be down yeah. in a sec. You know? Yeah, I don't think that's a feature, but all right. Really? The karaoke it. thing is your favorite, Sam. Come on. You know what? I'm putting you in timeout. Take five like minutes it. and think of something better. I quite like it. <laughs> I think so, like, it was one of the features I, that when I, when I used it, I was excited to try it. And just see see how it worked. And not many like software features you get excited to use for the first time. So I was kind of excited for it. I dude, could not love decide. It. Especially people I could in, like, not Brazil. decide between uh, unsend an iMessage or edit. No, I damn will, you! I'm going to pick edit. So you okay. you have unsend, Dan. It's open. But I pick edit and iMessage because uh, I'm just every time I messed <laughs> I'll mess something up and then just like hurry up and try to fix the reply, like fix the word, but then I'll mess that word up again and just it's just a string of me trying to correct myself where now I can just go back in, fix it, and leave. Does anyone else just do the the asterisk and then just correct yourself the old way and just still That's do that? That's what I'm saying. Yes, I try to do that, but <laughs> I mess up my correction too. Oh, my gosh. Because I'm trying to do it too fast. So have you programmed yourself to like take the extra minute so it's, and edit? It's like 50-50. Okay. Sometimes I still like... I forget that it's there, but well, the undo fine. send. So I, mine wasn't really just like necessarily one feature. It was just all the messages feature like lumped into one. Um, mm -hmm. And so with undo send, my only issue is that there's some people still that like don't update all of their devices. And mm -hmm. I'm worried that if something that I deleted should not be seen, <laughs> that it could yeah. still be seen. Apple needs to figure out a way. Well, they're not going to. They're just going to wait for everybody to update. And they, yeah. you know, they do have a pretty good success rate in terms of getting everyone to update pretty quickly. Uh, but I still don't like the fact that they can still see the messages. So let me. I'm only friends with people that have updated software. Those are the rules. What, you said about, what about people like me or others that have a lot of devices somewhere throughout their home and studio and don't have the time to turn those on and update them? I mean, their automatic updates exist, Dan, so I don't know what you're saying. Just know that I won't look at them, so don't worry. <laughs> um, I Here's my problem with undo send. You never use it because it's only available for, what, two minutes? No, it's 15, right? No. Dude, how, what do you mean? When are you, when are you going to undo stuff an hour later? <laughs> the conversation. Yeah, it's over. usually pretty pretty quick, but I thought when it's you more sober up right? around when one. When you when you I hit like the Uber and you that. sober up around one, you're like, maybe I shouldn't have texted that. Hold on, right? Hartley's our resident fact checker. Hartley, I don't know. <laughs> two to three. It's two or three minutes. No, no, no. I'm not. This isn't like a guess. Like it's two or three minutes. To you do stuff. well. You. It kind of sounds like a guess when you give me two different options. I think they changed it. They did change it at some they point. Did. That's all. It's I not two to be three it. minutes. I'm googling it. I'm googling it. Right. I don't see it. What do I win Unsend when I send iPhone time length? Come on. There's four of us here. How is this so hard? Fifteen minutes. Fifteen minutes. No, yeah. That's all. I was right. This that's was from June six. So he. He is correct. That might be changed, but I no. It's it oh, you're is. right. It is up to two minutes after they did change. Thank it. you. So we were technically both right, though. <laughs> uh, no, you were right in June, Dan. <laughs> is to I don't know what month it is. It's been a blur. When did it get changed? Because Dan might have been right for longer than you were. 
No, it changed during the beta cycle, and Mac Rumors wrote about it. Your own site. Get clapped. Get owned. <laughs> okay. <laughs> We've been through this. I don't watch YouTube. I don't read Mac. No, I'm just kidding. You, bro, what do you do <laughs> no, all day? Huh? What do you I do, do all day? All... I just, I sit in a bubble with like yeah. very little internet and I just make the, vi I'm like a rat in a cage making videos. Yes, yes. I don't know anything else that's going on. Every time you press upload, Arnold just drops off a cube of cheese and you just start. <laughs> yeah, they just wipe, they just wipe my memory and then I have to relearn everything again for the next day. Yeah. Um, that's but not true, that, by the see, way. My, my thing when it's only <laughs> it's for legal reasons. Legal reasons. I don't want Arnold reasons, getting I'm not trouble. a rat who eats cheese. Just I'm, not an, I'm not in a cage. <laughs> <laughs> um, what was I going to say? Oh, yeah. The the undo send, though. Like, I I, I think it should have been at least – it should – I mean, other platforms, you can just unsend at any point. So, for me, it's just like – yeah, it would just be nice. It's not like I'm sending, like, things that I want to unsend constantly. It's just when I do – just send every that set. text that I'm like, ah, I should have waited on that one. I'm like it. I'm like, oh, now it's it's 16 minutes in and I can't. Hartley. Yeah. Or I Sam, was that yours? Are you agreeing with us? Hartley already yes. gave it. Hartley already gave it to him. I'm, I'm sorry. I can't keep track of what's going on sure. anymore. Well, sorry, well, he's, like, he's got so the early on. Set I do have another 16. one, too, that we can talk about. <laughs> Go uh, so ahead. The redesign lock screen. Yeah, I that's think a, it's a really a, good update. That's it's a, a very that's, respectful answer. Yeah, it's good. I just don't. I don't use it. What you don't put widgets yeah. on your lock screen? I don't. What did you? What did you just call me? I said you don't put widgets on your lock screen. Bro, don't call me a widget, okay? I'm more than <laughs> I'm more than a little accessory. Uh, no, I actually don't. I'll show you my lock screen right now. <laughs> I'm the, do you use always on display? Basic, I'm such a basic sheep. <laughs> Oh my I, gosh. Yeah, I'm the same way. So I say this all the time in my videos. I don't like tinkering. I mean, you wouldn't know, Dan, because you don't watch, but I don't like tinkering with stuff. I don't want, like, I'm glad that they're adding more abilities to customize stuff for people who want to do that. Usually people who are, like, 14 and have nothing to do after school. Um, no, okay. Wow. No. Uh, yeah. That, Look uh, at this. Not true. <laughs> I've got I've got Spotify know, but... and TikTok so that I can feed my addiction quicker. You and you're like, how do you have that? <laughs> I have customization widgets in there. That's how far I'm going. You don't have Apple Music. Do you sing? follow? <laughs> I do not have. Do you Apple follow Music my sing. TikTok then at I'm Sam Cole. Do you follow my TikTok? Who are you again? God, I'm just a widget. <laughs> Sam Cone from Good Morning America. Nothing but a widget. Sam Cone from Good Morning okay, America. Okay, what, oh what? What's the next category? I need it. My brain's hurting. All right, Hartley, go on. Well, are we all in agreement that we don't even need to do worse software feature because it's just stage manager? No, yeah. I have one. Okay. I like Go it. Go on. Go on. The always on display is god awful. Oh, come on. That's no, not, Dan, first off, that's a hardware don't feature with, too. Don't start with It's not I mean it is, but it it's a it's, <laughs> the hardware is there. Hang on, time out. The hardware is there to facilitate the software feature. That's what that sure. is. Sure. Okay. Even after okay. the sixteen point two update, you still don't like it. That's fine, but you, we're talking about the whole year. Don't shrug, Dan. What's the worst <laughs> software feature that's been introduced all year? The always on display. I would call that a hardware feature. I'm going to be honest. Pre 16.2. No, what are you talking about? Okay. It's a hardware in feature. It's not on any other phone. 16, time out. In 16.2, they changed. The they, <laughs> in 16.2, they changed how the, how the always on display works, right? How did they do that, Sam? Through hardware, or was it a software feature that rolled out in an update? Hey, how do I get I, the always uh, on? How do I get the always on display software feature on my iPhone 12? What? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> That's not. <laughs> you're... This is I, the most like, unhinged like Mac like like podcast bad, ever, and I'm take, so in love with it. Bad person page tech. Oh my God. Bad. The, person. You're the worst. You're the absolute worst. Well, Worst human Dan. of 2022. Go. Sam Cole. <laughs> really? There's a lot of really bad humans out there. We're going to go with Dan, Sam? You, you're really going to argue that this is a hardware feature when the hardware is there to facilitate the software feature? Oh, I don't yeah, know but what it, this facilitation is, bro. <laughs> it, that, do you not know words? If I go into the church and facilitate a service, I'm not a pastor. What do you mean? Like, What? Exactly. <laughs> so, <laughs> wow, you got me. I oh, wish I had everybody. sound effects on right now. I just want to say that while I do not use the always on display, I'm happy it's here and people seem to really like it. But I do not use it. No. Oh, I didn't really like it 
when it was Does first announced. But then after a software feature, hey, hey, there you go, John. After a software update, um, I like that it can go black like that. And now it's using less battery and it's not yep. as distracting. People can't see the weird <laughs> pictures of myself that I put as my background. Um, I just use pictures of me. It's Hartley. not my kids. Do <laughs> you, you use... My, I wallpaper just Hartley all the time. <laughs> do you? Me too. Does Hartley use the always on display? Uh, I do. I, I can never decide if I if I if I like it or how I want it to be. It's like the lock screen. But I it's customizing bad. the lock screen. I just yeah. It's like I, I don't I don't I don't know. I quite like it on my desk. I like to be able to see like the time. It's just nice, you know, in my peripheral vision. But it's not worth sacrificing my battery life. So I can I kind of turn, it's like on my Apple Watch. I, I depending on the time of year, I kind of turn it on, turn it off. Um, I can never quite never quite work out if I fully like it or not. It's the worst uh, implementation. Of an always on display. Yeah, it's ever. a software feature. Yeah, it's no, a. It's, it's a John. Uh, John, my own it's co-host. The same. No, no, no. I'm they, going. It's literally the same now put... as an Android. It's black and white. What do you mean? It's the worst implementation. It's. But he the doesn't same like Android. Now. He doesn't like Android. No, I'm talking about when it was introduced. The worst implementation. We're not We're talking, talking about, about that. It's gone, bro. He is. He John is correct that I did say of the whole year. So if he wants Sam, to go back in time, he can. You do are that. lucky that this is somebody else's podcast. <laughs> really, what I can't quit the Mac Rumors podcast, but I can quit ours. <laughs> I mean, I get, you could technically leave if you wanted to, but no, please don't, I because couldn't. the next the next category is a is a crazy one. I don't even know where we're at on this list. Harley, what's the next category? Uh, let I don't know what it is. Uh, <laughs> best accessory introduced this year. Okay, I'll play the worst. So accessory. for me, Air, AirPods is, Pro Two. Yeah, this is gonna yep. be everybody's. That's yeah, be for me. AirPods Pro Two. Uh, I, I think disagree. It's such a great disagree. I think that get? in terms of all the devices this year, AirPods Pro 2 introduced so much. It was, other than a redesign, it, every it other element of it was almost better. completely overhauled. Um, and I, the, the features just keep coming. Even stuff we didn't expect, like um, the ability to use an Apple Watch charger or the touch volume controls we mentioned earlier. Um, mm -hmm. It's a it's, a, the it's an underrated on, update. The speaker on the case, too, is uh, actually very useful. Yeah. I do like yeah. the little and ding it gives position me. Position finding, yeah. Ding. Yeah. Yeah. Sam's gonna <laughs> Sam's gonna poo poo on them, but keep in mind Sam yeah. has baby ears and can't use AirPods Pro and has to use the regular AirPods because nothing fits in his ears. You do have Actually, to preface that if you have baby ears and they don't fit. Opinion. Yeah. Actually, I I'm gonna I have an update to that story that is shocking, and uh -oh. I will be saving it for a video that will be going up on my channel sometime soon. Boo. But that is not my answer for best accessory. Yay. Genuinely, the accessory I've enjoyed the most Apple is an Music actual sick. accessory. <laughs> it's no, no, it's not a pro. You guys just named a product. Like AirPods are not really an accessory. They're like, they, what are you they, talking about? They are an accessory. You can't use them by yourself. You can't. You can't use them by themselves. You've yeah, got to use I them can... with another device. They're an accessory Sam, to. Sam is just making stuff up. I, well, I hold on. What's your accessory? Apple. What's your accessory? The Apple Watch Ultra Bands. They are okay. so cool. They are okay. so much fun, and. Like it's just a really fun time. I just I I'm, I love Fine. that there's like different ones. When I'm going into the mountains, I'll put the Alpine Loop on. When I'm going for a run and I'm not sick because I've gotten sick constantly lately, I'll be you know the Trail Loop. Everybody at Planet Fitness is like, "Damn, does that guy have the Trail Loop?" And I'm like, "It oh, is. Yeah, it is dude. the. It is the yeah. nicest one." Yes, Dan, let's it, go, it, Harley. It do you really have the is. Ultra? No, no, I don't. My my wrist's too small. You know, oh, I man. I can't I can't get away with it. But I do. I love the. Uh, I love the bands. I would agree. You could, you could still get it for your forty whatever okay. millimeter. Okay. So this is probably oh, going to make one. everybody. I can't. I can't. You've got the little one. Oh, little heart. <laughs> I do. I do. Aww. It's so cute. We got baby ears and baby wrists. So <laughs> if we were the same person. We'd just be Ian Zelda. <laughs> um... <laughs> oh, Ian. Okay. So I have a joke where I t I tell Ian uh, that he's so skinny. <laughs> When he dies and they cremate him, it's going to look like somebody put out a cigarette. <laughs> and that's his employer, everybody. <laughs> Imagine if Arn said that about you, Hartley. I don't think that's allowed. Oh, no. oh, I might have to edit that out, but that was good. <laughs> Why would you have to edit that out? I don't know. I mean, I personally don't care. Offensive? I'm, it's not a fit. Maybe it might be offended. I don't know. I gotta no, ask him. I tell, I tell it to him all the time. <laughs> he gets paid for me to say that to him. Okay, sorry. 
All right, all right. Hold on, hold on. I have something that might be a little de- and if divisive. You edit that out, I will never come on this show again. I'll be extremely disappointed. All right, fine. Then I'll keep it on. I don't care. Okay, thank you very much. Less work for me. I mean, geez. Um, <laughs> okay, hold on. Hartley disagrees with me. And I, I mean, I kind of disagree with myself, but also I can make an argument. What? The Apple Watch, in my opinion, is an accessory. No one, it is. not many, well, no, because you can technically use it as a standalone device, but who does that? But it's, an, and it, it's an accessory to your body. I agree. I think watches are accessories. Just because it's a smartwatch doesn't mean. It's an accessory to your body, John. Get over yourself. Yeah, but you really can't have a good all around experience, in my opinion, if you don't have the phone with it. It, it, that's again. So my my best accessory, honestly, my first thought was the Apple Watch Ultra, just because it's so much better than any other Apple Watch that you can get. And I'll fight someone if they don't agree with me. Um, I don't agree. Well, then we're gonna fight. <laughs> <laughs> no, but, but there's, I, there's, there's I, I disagree for different reasons. I I like the I like them. I like my watches to look like jewelry, and the Apple Watch Ultra does. And not. that's and that's fine. I think from just like a pure feature standpoint and what it can do, <laughs> it's better. I also do think it looks nice. If you put a nice band, you could put that band on this, and it would get you'd get away with it. Sam, don't you dare! Don't you Go dare ahead. be upset that I said I like that it looks like jewelry. Don't You're the one you... that wears super. You wear like Balenciaga and Supreme. Listen, I I was just gonna just strongly disagree with John. The Apple Watch does not look like jewelry. It has never looked like jewelry. Okay, no, 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 no. it is no, a screen. Oh. It, this looks closer to. Oh, jewelry look at Hartley! You're breaking Apple Hartley's Apple. heart. Yeah. No, it's just like well, that's what the Apple Watch MS is. There's a whole, whole, there's a whole yeah. category of Apple Watch that's no, designed around that. it's not an AP. It's not a Roly. Okay, no, like, it's. Yeah, yeah, I don't even have screen. this man on the show. I can't take. <laughs> I cannot take. He's your podcast. Actually, the fun fact: Sam is our 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 most reoccurring guest of all time. Well, I'm coming really? on next. Week. How many times do I have to come on to beat Aww. him? You, just two, one more, right? Two, two. You one more will tie him. I've been on before. Yeah. He's been on three times. Why? I don't know. I would just Good for ratings, bro. <laughs> this is, this is just like CNN. We just scream, and it's like, whoop. I think it's up. because I have the most fun when Sam's on, because we just yell, and so that's – it's just oh. fun. When we don't have this a cat, when we don't have a topic, we just yell. I love Dan. I mean, you had a topic today, and we're still yelling, so. Oh, no. It's, I, I mean, yeah, that's the whole point. <laughs> but now we're all yelling at each other, which is nice. Yeah, I would never yell at Hartley though. Just want to make that clear. I appreciate it. <laughs> <laughs> well, all right, Hartley. Let's let's get into the next one. Maybe they'll yell at you for your answer. Never. Uh, no, uh, this one is I. Th- there's a lot of choices for this one, which would be uh, the most neglected Apple product of the year, the one that Apple has kind of discarded, forgotten about. Um, maybe they've given a disappointing update. Maybe they've just not updated it. Um, for me, it would be the. Uh, Mac, the high-end Mac Mini, because that has not been updated oh. basically since 2018, and it's still. Everyone talks about yeah. old. You know, the Mac Pro is the last Intel Mac. It's not. This is the this is the real one that more people buy. Um, yeah, and is actually probably more useful to server farms, um, institutions like that. Mm. And it's it's just been <laughs> left since 2018. We're going into 2023, and it's still the same, and it's still more expensive than the M1 model. So that's that's my choice. That's a really good answer. I would say the Apple TV. It just got yeah. updated though. Okay. It's not. Yeah. That's no. It's a, it's, it, it was a pity update. Yeah, it was horrible. I mean, I love the Apple TV as a product. It's, it's still great. it's still good, but they yeah. they neglected that part. Yeah, I guess. I, you know, as a as a, as a like pro user, I use the Mac Pro. You know. When I'm not mm-hmm. getting fit checked, I'm just kidding. I don't actually have a Mac Pro. I just really want to see like an expandable version. Um, I kind of feel like in 2022, I don't know. I kind of feel like I feel like we're starting to see a little bit of neglect on the Mac again. Well, oh, are just, you I How many drugs from a scale from <laughs> one to all of them? How many drugs are you on right now? Zero. I'm completely sober. How could you say that? He's just sleepy. That's like the been ma- their focus for the last two years. I said in 2022. I said we're starting. Did we, didn't we get a Mac? Didn't we get Mac Studio in 2022? This is my yep. point. Mac Studio, not that great of a product. Can I leave? Whoa, whoa, yeah, you can leave. It's fine. I'll, I'll I'm uh, actually going to leave th- too. I say this, by the way, 
<clears throat> as someone what? who uses the Mac Studio every single day. What's your issue? I just – mine has been very glitchy. My SD card slot is like only works about half the time. Hmm. Um, the headphone jack being on the back is a big miss. I will say the SD card slot. Did you notice the same thing as me when you put it in to it like kind of we does this weird click and then when you take it out I feel like it's like damaging the sides of the SD card or is that just mine? Okay, so this is yeah, I I feel like mine I have to like push in twice. It won't even read my yeah. one memory card half the time. Yeah, you have to uh, push it in twice. And then I, I it's have, damaging yeah. it. And then it's damaging. It. I've had two that have ri like like broken off in the same spot. What? It still works. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Zero yeah, problem. No, no, you're right. That has happened to me. Yeah. What? I have an yeah. SS I have an SD card in there right now. I'm going to start pu I'm pushing it in and out to see if it breaks. I mean, it's it's like kind of an overtime okay. thing. So like, why don't I you mean, for the next 20 minutes just sit there and keep taking it in and out <laughs> okay. and then we'll but, and then we'll check back. <laughs> I just and, and like the M2 chip was not up to what we thought it would be. Like, let's just be mm. honest. The M2 chip's just Well, the M2 chip's not in the Mac Studio. So is that your separate answer? Well, this is, I said the Mac in general, but I, okay, I these okay, are my okay. illustrations. Like the Mac Studio was just eh, um, and then Whoa. we didn't really get any other like I, I, I mean the MacBook Air is pretty cool, but you know we also saw some controversy about like the M2 chip and the way it'd be working in these like like the Mac 13 inch MacBook Pro with M2. It's a <sighs> weird thing. See, this is going like to be fuzzy when we get into the best overall new product because I'm going to the guy disagree. the same guy that said the Dynamic Island makes. <laughs> Smile said that the Mac Studio. <laughs> hey, I, I, I use. I feel like that's a fair thing for me to say. I use. It's not like I'm speaking on something. I, I I've only used the Mac Studio every day. And all right, I no, just, listen. I appreciate the the different answer because that's definitely expect, not any of ours. <laughs> I it doesn't it does like when I use the MacBook Pro that feel like it feels like a multi thousand dollar product. The Mac Studio just doesn't feel like a seven something grand product that I paid for it. Uh, I don't know if I can agree. All right. S fight me. Keep going with the categories. Well, no, we're still – I didn't answer mine. Well, John, did you give yours? I'm pretty sure I did. M most I neglected? Apple, T Apple TV. Oh, that's right. That's oh, right. Yeah. And Hartley you gave yours. I didn't say mine. Mine's AirPods Max. I am very disappointed that we haven't had an update in a while, and it's seemingly being neglected, and I would like to see something other than, like, the rumored new colors. Like, I don't care about that. You you did such That's an improvement for two years. Yeah, and you've did you've done such a good improvement with the AirPods Pro too. Let's start seeing some of those things make its way into the five hundred and fifty dollar. You know, I love the AirPods Max. I want them. I just want a new version. Because this is I, not, here's my. You just, we ahead. keep bringing up AirPods Pro too, so I just want to just give them a, a mention. They are so good. They so, are so. No, they they are phenomenal uh, for those tiny little earbuds, and uh, I'm very happy with them. AirPods have been like, I think they're my favorite Apple products. Like all of them, even the Macs. Yeah, uh, just because like, so I I need the Macs. Obviously, I absolutely need them for my work and stuff. But uh, I would if I didn't if I wasn't working, if this wasn't my job, I would I probably wouldn't need a Mac. The air the AirPods are have, have just been a fun, always working, reliable accessory that is just like I can I can. There's no faults with the, with the new ones. I just they sound much better. They're du they're double they're doubly as good as the previous model, and so no complaints. They're very good. Apple nailed it this year with those. I agree. Yeah. Well, uh, is that going to be your answer for best overall new product of 2022? Which is I think these are our final two categories. No, I, I I pick Mac Studio for that. Oh, would what? you care to elaborate? Yes, <laughs> I would. Uh, I first of all, it's a completely different like category of Mac that they introduced, and that's I I love I love currently what it is. I have zero complaints with it, but I also love the potential for this product line. I think it was I think it's a really cool middle ground between Mac Mini and Mac Pro, and spe especially specifically how they. They marketed it for us, for creators. That's like what that was their whole pitch, and the fact that they're even paying attention to that market, uh, I I admire. I really like that. So yeah, Max Studio is my favorite. That's been my like, uh, like the other day I sat down and um, did you smile? Like, yeah, I smiled. <laughs> I smiled. I was like, hello, Max Studio. Uh, no, I, I just this is a product that I really appreciate. I have no problems with it. 
I don't know. I've never had any. I know that you you might have, Sam. That's fine. But I've never had any glitches or anything wrong with it. Um, it's reliable. I, I use it to work every day, and uh, couldn't I? My job wouldn't exist without it. So, thank you, Mac Studio. All right, Sam or Hartley. Apple Watch Ultra, hands down. And why? Absolute what What has it done to or make your life up. better? Best in every single way. The action button, the larger screen, the bigger battery, the new bands, the whole new design, the beautiful titanium finish for $800. Dude, it's everything I've ever wanted in a watch. They finally innovated upon the watch for the first time in years, and it's an actual upgrade. The dual GPS, don't even get me started, bro. It's amazing. <laughs> Harley? Uh, well, I think it would probably be AirPods Pro 2 for me, but... I will think I will go with iPhone 14 Pro because I, this oh. was the first um, iPhone upgrade for several years at this point, which has felt meaningful. Um, you know, iPhone 12, I think, kind of tricked us with its redesign, but it was basically the same as iPhone 11 Pro. And iPhone 11 Pro, yeah, how, how much was that doing other than the cameras over the over the iPhone 10s again? So this was a fir- this was the first year where I feel like we we saw innovation. Um, almost across the whole device. USB-C would have helped a lot, but I love the 48 megapixel camera. Um, I appreciate Dynamic Island. Let's let's go with that. That's probably a slight make you smile. Uh, it's making a smile right now. Um, <clears throat> and uh, uh, I I really like um, uh, the update as a whole. I think that it's bringing quite a lot together. I wasn't expecting to see a four nanometer chip this year um, in the flagship iPhone. So for me, I think that's what it would be. Does anyone care to know what mine is? Yeah. That was, no one else responded except for Sam. Thanks, Sam. (laughs) Uh, The M2 MacBook Air, I think, is the best laptop that Apple makes, hands down. I would have. By far. Dan, Dan, Dan. I don't got my decision. You're insane. It is the best laptop, by far. For everyday everyday humans. Everybody, it's- Dan from Mac Rumors is back off the wagon. <laughs> <laughs> will be, I will be with him at AA this week. Sam is the most frustrating human ever. He his bubble no. is up here. He's like he's like a if Reddit was a person, it's Sam. Everything is like up here. It has to be the best. It has to have pro after it. He doesn't understand the market. You have no, 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 no comprehension no, 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 no. of the market at all. Listen, the I MacBook Air is phenomenal. I also feel like Sam half the time where I'm like, if I'm going to buy something for myself and not do it for my job, I would probably just go pro. But doing this job has opened up my eyes and seeing that there are other products out there that might actually just be better for everybody else. And honestly, I, I don't know if I'm going to do this yet, but when I go to CES, I'm strongly just thinking taking the M2 MacBook Air. I don't need anything else. It gets the basic it's edits lighter, done for me. It's lighter, it's lighter sleeker, fits on the actual the tray screen. table in there when you're crammed in coach because I'm poor. And so like, I don't get the extra room. Dan, I just sit. And, yeah. Because we had this argument on Genius Bar. Okay. For me personally, I will lead with an example for me. For me personally, 13 inches. To travel or to just <sighs> have a portable laptop, 13 inches is the best screen size. Do you agree or disagree? Uh, for traveling, like the yes. Fifteen point five inch MacBook Air that's going to come out. Oh, but see, that's the thing. I might, I would probably be inclined to to pick that one just because there. No, because I would probably use then the MacBook Air if it's if it remains its power and efficiency. Um, and let's keep in mind, I updated the max amount of RAM on that. That is crucial in my opinion. If you're trying to mm-hmm. get away with the base model, which is probably what a lot of people who tested it, they went out, they bought the base model because it was the quickest one to, and that's really, I did the same thing and I was like, oh, I don't know if I like this, but it, it's what, 20, up to 24 gigs of RAM. Yeah. I went up to 24. You I probably don't need 24. I was shocked that they allowed you to do that with the MacBook Air. Even just that. I was like, oh, I'd we're, say do, we're s- playing this game. I say 16 in a terabyte is probably good, but if you're someone who is going to be using some apps like, you know, something that would that would need a lot of that memory, uh yeah, I would definitely bump it up and you're good. Safari. You can do you can do yeah, Safari, yeah, exactly. <laughs> you can do what you need to do and I would probably make that my main laptop everywhere I go all the time if it if it did have a slightly bigger screen because oftentimes while it is great for traveling, if I'm at home, I do want the bigger screen real estate. So um, yes and no, I agree with you, John, that it is probably the best screen size for mostly everything, but I do sometimes 
switch back to the MacBook Pro, and I'm like, all right, I can see why this bigger screen is useful. Mm -hmm. Stop the count. Why? Listen. Oh, boy. You just, you just don't get to say that the MacBook Air is a better laptop than the MacBook Pro. The MacBook Pro just smokes did. it in every single way. But Damn, that, yeah, I mean, stop thinking about numbers on paper. It does not matter. Right. Stop. It doesn't. Stop I'm it. not talking about numbers on. When did I say anything about the specs? You said it's better. Or, or, yes, on paper, it's better. When did I say way. anything about the, the processor? I'm not talking about the, the processing speed. I'm talking about the fundamental experience to have ports on a machine, to have insane speakers on a machine, to have 120 hertz on a machine, I'm to have mini about LED on a machine. <laughs> Listen, these are just things that you like. Those four things are worth the upgrade in a heartbeat for you to the MacBook Pro. Yeah. I, what are, what I, are we, aren't we all arguing for? Who are we arguing for? We're arguing for ourselves, I thought. I or, just I, don't, it wasn't, you're it wasn't trying what to is the people's choice favorite saying, product? Hold on, let, let, Hartley, product, let okay? Hartley bring us down. He's the voice of reason. Hartley, help, help. So, I have a 14-inch MacBook Pro, um, and I love it, but I am so tempted to buy a MacBook Air. Boom. No. And it's Boom. because three on and one. The, and, the, and the thing that and the thing that stops me is it's the it's the display because I really like ProMotion and I really like mini LED. Yeah. But um the thing that just it gets me is the MacBook Pro is heavy. Um and it's just ever so slightly too big. Um and it means that carrying it around is just I, I feel like I want something a little bit more nimble. Um nimble. and nimble have, uh, that's the word. something that's a little bit more versatile Dude. um you know just like something you can just throw in a backpack a little bit more easily i mean yeah. it's, it's like there's barely anything in it but you know the the little you know extra few millimeters shaved off it it does it counts dude i'm it, bringing it makes it feel like a different device i'm bringing cameras lenses stuff you know an ipad because i'm not gonna it's just better you know experience for watching stuff on a plane I can't fit all of that and a 16-inch MacBook Pro and walk around for days at an event or something and 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 have all that weight. It's just in and just taking out the MacBook Pro already makes it so much lighter in general. Just going from a six. Now I don't have the 14, so let's preface that by saying maybe is that what you're using, Sam? Is the 14 the reason why you oh, love it? The 16-inch biggest, heaviest one that they make, <laughs> and I take that. I put that in Coach. I put that in Economy Plus. I put that on my desk. I put that in the hotel lobby, baby. I put that everywhere. You guys are absolute soy boys. You're like, the few soy millimeters. Boys. Hartley, it's like the few millimeters that they shave off helps me put it in the backpack. It's like, bro, it's a difference of a pound. You can't throw a pound around. Pretty sure you guys know a thing or two about the pound, if I'm correct. My you point could, is, you could, you could keep, is, you could keep oh. saying this forever, though. You could keep oh, that was a, that was, okay, that was a clever joke. Got it. This is the 16 inch. Oh my, device, oh, my poor arm. On my the, poor the arm can't things. handle it. I have to set it down for the 14 inch. Listen, bro, <laughs> you guys are all insane. Where is Luke Miani when I need him? This is the most insensitive towards English folk I have ever heard. <laughs> are, are you surprised? I'm sorry. We can no, talk about Dan, if you only knew how much got cut out of Gene's part to save Sam's career. Well, I guess I'll experience it next week, right? <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, you will. You're gonna know. He already you, forgot. Jesus Christ. He already NBA. forgot. I wanna <laughs> make him sign at eight PM when we record. Was that? Oh, yeah. We recorded eight PM. You record at eight PM? I've got kids. Yeah, bro. It's late it's late night chilling time. <laughs> oh, it's like Jesus eight to Christ. eleven. All right. Eight to eleven? Put him in you, Dude, you, I'm fifty nine years old. How in the hell am I gonna stay up until eleven? Ha what how old did you say? I'm fifty nine. Yeah. Yeah, no you're not. Yeah, he is. Are you kidding? Ha, 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 very funny. No, you're I'm not. fifty I'm fifty nine, dude. Dan, you are not I, <laughs> prove it. Can you prove it? Yeah, hold yeah, on. Get his license right you now. have my phone number. I'll send you a picture of my license. Yeah. I do not I do not believe this. Yeah. What, are you s Worst Apple feature of the year. Dan lying <laughs> about his age. Yeah. All right, real quick, real quick. Hartley's got four minutes. A poor man has to go off. I'm so sorry. To do I just something. made fun of him in his last ten minutes. Oh, four, four. Yeah, you just. <laughs> Hartley, do you need to defend yourself first off, or are you good? Yeah. I I think I think uh, the less said, the better. Yeah, really? and and I and we all agree yeah. with you. So don't worry. Don't listen to Let Sam. Sam. He's get unhinged. In trouble. He's unhinged. Yeah. Um,
what the worst product, <laughs> worst overall new product of 2022. You're I will start. About. I what? No, You're not the. About. We did. Oh, we did because I had to pivot because we couldn't think of a of a worst update. All right. Well, then we're then we're it. That's we're done. Where does everyone yeah. want to go listen to your? Where do we where do we go listen to your podcast? Is it all on Wait. one specific? Pla- is it on MySpace? Yeah, on MySpace <laughs> only. Will you I, have to visit our profile page and it will automatically play in the background. That's a good idea. I ha- I have a fun final category. What? Best Apple YouTuber. All right, we got. All right, guys, that's our show. Uh, this is. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining us, Genius Bar Podcast. Sam and John, appreciate it. This is Thanks, the most guys. unhinged Apple award show ever, and I hope we can do this every single year until I eventually retire in six is years. Is this going to be a tradition so where thank you. We're, we're bars on for the award show? Uh, we can. Yeah, why not? That'd we'll see. We'll, we'll see, though. We have a lot of comments that we'll probably have to sift through after this. Uh, and yeah. if everyone doesn't cancel don't read, don't read Sam. On it. Mac- <laughs> and remember, comments, they're not kind to me. Everything that I said, I mean 100%, and none of it was sarcasm. <laughs> thank you so much. And That's yeah. Okay, Thanks thank you for having us. Thank you for letting me ruin your show. Thank you for letting me speak to your audience. And I just really appreciate you guys, and I hope you have a warm holiday. And I actually think the UK is really cool, and I'm jealous I don't live there, and that's why I acted out. I mean, I do agree with that. So You guys make me smile. So, but Not as thank much as the family. <laughs>